welcome back. This is a new script that I've just completed uh, that adds more immersion and complexity to the mine detection and clearance process. Uh, the basic process requires that the group leader um, will search for the mine, uh, for search for mines using a mine detector. And once the mine is detected, the, the AO, AI EOD specialist will take over and deactivate the mine. Um, this is a script only process, so there are no mods needed. You need at least one suitably equipped AI with a mind detector and a toolkit in your team. The player must be the team leader. And if the player group leader wants to handle the entire process of mind detection uh, and deactivation, he can just toggle off the AI demining uh, action menu. Uh, the group leader will use a custom mind detector to detect mines. And when the mine is detected, uh, EOD specialists will automatically take over the disarming process. Um, he will then either manually disarm the mine, or if it's an IED, he'll use a remotely detonated explosive charge. Uh, if a mine is detected in a building, then the AI EOD specialist will hand over the, to the player. The player will then have to deactivate and clear the building, which is not an easy process. Um, the player has access to a demining UGV, which you can spawn, which you can spawn in and connect to the action uh, through the action menu. Uh, then the player can use the UGV to assess the risk and determine which disarming method is the best. Uh, the main features are custom mine detector, action menu options to spawn UGV and remove UGV, action menu to use and store the mining detector. Uh, you can whitelist mines uh, and explosive devices to prevent them being detected and disarmed by the EOD AI. Uh, automated AI disarming process, all terrestrial mines are supported, enhanced explosion effects, uh, custom EOD voices and warnings, uh, in-building detection of mines and IEDs, uh, detected mines are flagged with red and blue flags denoting armed and de deactivated uh, mine states. Uh, nearby civilians and Blue Force units react to, de, uh, to detected mines and will move to a safe distance until the threat has been neutralized. Uh, that crowd control kind of capability is really cool when you see it in action. I'll show it to you now. Um, EOD uniform and helmet mines are supported and, and have no effect on the Ross mine clearance system. Third-party scripts or mods that modify AI behavior will potentially break this uh, system. So uh, you can't use some other uh, system that modifies the AI FSM, for example. Um, the script runs entirely on the team leader's machine. Okay, so I'm going to show you the process now. Hold fire! Assalamu alaikum. Alaikumu assalam. We are searching for insurgents who have been planting explosives or IEDs in this area. Have you or any of the villagers seen any strange activity recently? Yes, late last night. There were some strangers that came here on motorcycles. They were digging over there on the side of the road. I think they were searching for something. They were armed so we didn't try to speak to them. They were searching for about an hour, then they left towards Gedem Chako. Thank you for your help. You and your family need to stay in your house until we've checked the area. We'll let you know once we've completed the search.
device detected. Move to a safe radius of approximately 40 meters. Stand by. Fire in the hole.
Attention all nearby units. IED detected. I'm going to use an explosive charge to remotely detonate. Move to a safe radius of approximately 60 meters. Stand by. Fire in the hole. Okay, this demo mission and the scripts will be uploaded to the Steam Workshop within a few days. Thanks for watching. Cheers for now.